Welcome to the third part. In this part we are going to work on the repository. Repository is the bridge between the data layer and the domain layer. Actual implementations of the repositories and the data layer. Repositories are responsible for coordinating data from the different data sources. The repository at the domain layer is in the form of an abstract class in which there are functions that still need to be implemented. So it is in the repository at the data layer that we will start implementing the abstract classes. First we create a folder called repositories in the domain, and then create a file inside it called article repository. If you remember, we said that the domain layer contains only the interfaces, and the implementations will be in the data layer. So now we define an abstracted class named article repository. Now here we have to define our methods. Currently we have a method called get news articles that returns a future data of type article entity list, which wrapped with the data state to determine the state of the response. Now we have to implement the repository we created. As we said before the implementation should be done in the data layer. But before we do the implementation, we need to create the article model. Therefore, first we create a file called article in the data layer and in the models folder. Then here we define a class called article model. Article model fields are the same as article entity fields and also has a from JSON method. So here we extend the article entity and then define the fields. And finally, we create the from JSON method in this way. Now you may have a question. Why do we need a model and not use entity? Because as we said before, the domain layer must be independent and not depend on other layers. And if we want to use entity instead model in the data layer, we may change our database in the future or use XML instead of JSON and have to change the entity, which is against the rule of clean architecture. Now the next step is to implement the article repository. In the repository folder, we create a file called article repository and then define a class inside it called article repository implementation. Now for implementation, it is enough to use the keyword implements in front of the class name and then type the class that we want to implement, which is the article repository class in the domain folder. If we look at the error, we will find that the error says that you should implement the get news article function. This is the same function that we defined in domain as abstract. Therefore in this way, we create the defined method for implementation. Now here, instead of returning a list of article entities, the method should return a list of article model, because we should not use entities in the data layer. Now here we have to get the list of articles from the API and return it. So stay with me in the next video, and make sure hit the subscribe button to get next video.